Hello and welcome back to Ruthless Reviews, the film critique show that pulls no punches and takes no prisoners. That's right, and we are starting today with an absolute piece of content <laughs> that I've just been told is by the sponsor of today's video. Oh, I didn't know that. So, talk to me about the cinematography. Cinematography? Yeah, um, I felt the cinematographer did really well to get all the actors in all the shots. And I liked as well that they didn't cut off the top of the actors' heads at any point. No, no, they didn't. Uh, and that was a good move. Okay, great. And uh, what about the sound? Oh, I mean, you could hear all the words. Uh, a very good decision from the sound department to make sure that uh, we, as the audience, found everything audible. And it was just the actors we heard as well, wasn't it? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. You never heard any of the rest of the crew. Uh, the wardrobe department in particular were, were very quiet, which I think added a lot. And talk to me about this director as well. This director was very much behind the scenes, uh, uh, which is great, you know, that very much is the role of the director. Uh, not like that Hitchcock guy. Great if you like that kind of thing, you know, master of the art, uh, suspense, narrative. Uh, that's, that's fine if that's your thing. But he did have a habit of getting in front of the camera. Uh, and when that happened, as an audience member, you'd sort of go, oh, that's the director. They're, they're normally behind the scenes, not in them. And this director didn't do that? No, no. It was a very good decision on their part. Very well executed as well. You didn't even see a shoulder creep into frame. Um, in fact, I've never actually seen a director better at that than this one. Okay, absolutely. Well, I'd say that is our film of the week.